we know Australians are feeling the pinch when it comes to cost of living, but that has not slowed down spending this festive season. Boxing Day sales have seen thousands hit shopping precincts across the country as people try to snap up an end-of-year bargain. Joining me to discuss the latest data is Fleur Brown, Chief Industry Affairs Officer at the Australian Retailers Association. Fleur, sales galore at the moment. Do we know roughly how much was spent yesterday? Well, the forecast for yesterday's sales event were $1.25 billion for that one day. Uh, and then we're looking at a $23.9 billion spend in the period to the 15th of January, which is known as the post-Christmas sales period, uh, which is just slightly up on last year. How does this compare to Black Friday sales in November? Well, Black Friday sales are traditionally used for pre-Christmas purchasing, uh, so that's a big driver, uh, whereas Boxing Day sales are all about the clearances, a lot of people shopping for themselves and for their household, a bit of a different function. Uh, we have seen some of the Christmas spending brought forward as people look to get a bargain this year, definitely feeling that pressure on their household budgets and trying to reduce the overall cost of their, uh, their shopping. Uh, and with Boxing Day, we know many Australians have saved up uh, purchases for that period to try and get some of the necessary household items off their shopping list. How does it compare to last year? How much of an increase are we seeing? Yes, we're looking at just over a percent uh, of increase year on year, so we would call that quite modest. It's still a really good result in a cost of living crisis, so I think retailers can take some confidence from this as they head into the new year. Uh, however, there are, of course, many uh, nuances within those numbers, so the cost of doing business has increased enormously for many retailers, and that's factored into you know, that increased spend as well. How important are Boxing Day sales for retailers as we head into the new year? Boxing Day sales give a sense of momentum as they head into the January period. Uh, Christmas trading is absolutely critical. Many discretionary retailers make up to, to two-thirds of their profits during that time. Boxing Day is also essential uh, as a clearance event just to clear out that old stock and make way for the new and to give that confidence boost as they head into the new year with a, you know, with a new offering. What are shoppers usually going for when heating up the sales this week? Well, there's a really diverse range of clearance items on sale. You can get things in every category, of course. Uh, almost every category has stock left. And uh, particularly for fashion and clothing items, it's really important for retailers to clear out that stock to make way for the new, uh, the new look, the new trends, the new clothing and uh, accessory items for the new year. And so that's, that's a really big factor in many of the shopping exercises amongst Australians for the Boxing Day and uh, ongoing sales period through to mid-January.